Wait, so how much money do I have? Alright, 25. Yeah, I have 25. Let's see. 12. Okay, that equals 14. And I'm guessing this is where he is. Alright. And you get Dried Shroom first, and then Dizzy Dale. Okay. Thanks, sugar. Yes, sweetie. Thanks, sugar. Yeah, yeah, here we go. Alrighty, mister. What color is your mustache? Red, green, yellow, black. The truth is black, but what they want you to answer is yellow. Oops. What's wrong with me? That wasn't the right question at all. Uh, let's try this again. Um, okay, mister. What's your favorite color? It's still yellow. Uh-huh. Well, you check out... You know, the password. So, um, you must be an acquaintance for Don Pinata. Good for you. Yeah, I guessed. You can go through the door. Go on with your bad self. Let me sell my items first, because I don't want these. I mean, I'll keep the Dizzy Dale, but I don't want Dried Shroom. Dried Shroom's useless. I'll keep the Dizzy Dale. Okay, let's, we're gonna meet the mob boss, guys. Let's do this. Hey! Did... This is that office of the Pianta Syndicate. Don't tell me you know that. Why do you speak these like, do you know the way? In Knuckles language. If you got no business here, scram a lamb. What's with you, with wise guy? I ain't no jolly today. If you got a beef, spit out. Quick, or this is gonna hurt. Excuse me, you want, you want, uh, you want me to give you a ticket for the blimp. See, now to me, that's funny. You, a stand-up comedian. No, you ought to be. You got some nerve asking me for that. I'm Don Peñata. I make crying babies weep. You want, I should run this bum out on a rail, boss. Look at him. What a rub. You must like pain, funny guy. You just looking for trouble, what? Not so fast, boys. I like this kid's gr grumptition. He just came to talk, no? That ain't a crime. So we talk. You boys can't wait until we're done before you rough him up. You got it? So, I gotta assume you got a reason for waiting a ticket for the blimp we outwired it. What's that? You wanna help some brand? What got herself kidnapped? Ah, uh, to rescue this dame. You're out collecting the crystal stars. The crystal stars. Hey boss, ain't does things in the legend about the ancient treasure? Vinny, you're such a dope. Hey boss, this knucklehead believes in fairy tales. Bite your tongue. Don't listen to that lout. The treasure is is as real as I am. Everybody, just shut it. I don't care if the treasure is real or not. Get me? But I tell ya, I can't help but like a guy who wants to rescue some skirt he fell for her. I made my decision. You do me a little favor, and you get a your blimp ticket. Sounds fair, right? I'm not entirely sure I like the sound of this. It's easy. It's nothing. It's less than nothing. You s see... The thing is, my own daughter eloped with one of my young associates. 
they vanished, but it wasn't too long ago that they did. They ought to still be nearby. You gotta find my daughter, Francesca. And... And this Frankie. And bring them both here. If you are unable to bring them here, then all you gotta do is tell me where they are. Then I shall settle this master quickly. And with what is known as extreme prejudice. Boss, we don't know nothing about this guy. You can't rely on some goofball for this job. Yeah, boss, then he's right. Leave it to us to find Francisio. Quite you. It's cause you lugs can't find her that I gotta s swallow my pride and ask this guy. I hope you dopes ain't making complaints about my decision. You making complaints. No, boss. Whatever you say goes, boss. I don't know what I was thinking, boss. It won't happen again, boss. You're the boss, boss. Good. I'm glad we're all full of understanding for another. So, it is settled, yeah? Find my daughter here and see me. Fiance, Fiance and Frankie look like this. Okay, sounds simple enough. Thank you, got a picture. And just to make clear, if you don't find my daughter, your lack may turn trouble. Alright, well, I'll find them for you. They probably just spawned in the map somewhere, so hopefully it shouldn't take me that long to find them. I mean, they probably just spawned on the map, so it should be a little bit easy to find. But if they're underground, then that could be a humongous problem of ourselves. Hey, let's check the station, since we haven't been there at all, really quickly. Maybe they're over at the station. I don't think I can go that way, though. The blimp goes to Goodsville. Uh, not yet, because I don't have a ticket. Okay, well, we'll say they're not here yet, so we're still gotta keep looking. They should be in town, I believe. I also haven't been down here yet, so maybe they're down there. There they are. I knew it. Hey, back off, you creep! You want something, or you just, like, sidling up to people? What? Daddy asked you to find us and take us to him? Frankie, what should we do if Daddy finds us now? Oh, I don't know. And the boat's coming any minute. Dollface, maybe we ought to head back and try to talk to the boss one more time. No, Frankie. Don't say that. Don't you know what he'll do if... if we do that? Francisco, baby doll. If we can take... If, if we can just talk calm, like, with the boss, he'll understand. Oh, Frankie, my Frankie, don't you love me? Of course I love you, sugar cookie. More than anybody in the world. In the whole world. Then let's go, Frankie. Let's run. To the ends of the earth, if we have to. But Butter Biscuit, they already found uh, us out. We can't keep running forever. We can, Frankie. The more you can... The more you try to put out the flames of love... The hotter they burn. 
Until I marry you, no one will extinguish the flames of passion. No one! Don't you see, mister? I beg you, pretend you never saw us. Can you do that? Sorry. But, it, I can't let you do that. What, what? Did you say to me? You're a terrible man. Fine, have it your way, but we won't go with you. Never. I won't move from this spot. Oh man, what do I gotta do? It'd be crazy me. Okay, well I found him. But I don't know if I did the right response. I wanna say I did, but I don't know. I will say this toad right here looks very suspicious. But then again, it's probably just my eyes saying RPG. Oh, whatever. Oh, whatever should we do? We have to say something to that Don fellow. I must say, though, I don't fancy a run of terrible luck. That, that would be unfortunate. Maybe we can convince her somehow? We can try talking to her again. Ever since I activated that dialogue box, maybe we could talk to her again. You still not moving? You still not moving? I guess we'll just need to talk to the boss, I guess. Talk to the boss! Cause I'm pretty sure the boss knows the way to, uh... To... To talk to her daughter. She's she's about to run away, and, uh... She's not moving anywhere. But the thing is, we gotta have her over here. I know the boss is not gonna be happy about this, but we're gonna have to tell him to actually talk to her. Yo, boss! Oh, look who's coming back! That preferable mustache! You gotta brighten my mood. So give what you got! You know the whereabouts of the two runaways? Sure I do. I'll tell you. Oh, is that true, Fack? Roachboard, huh? Well done. I appreciate this favor I've done. I'll prepare the blimp tickets. Hey, hey, you two Nimrods. The kids are at the harbor. Now go get them. Daddy, wait! Francisa. Boss. Forgive me, boss. I'm sorry, truly I am. Frankie, so back you came, heading hung low and a wit. You're tall between your legs. No, daddy, don't hurt him. I'm the one who said we should elope. It was me. But Frankie said no. He said we should come back and talk to you, daddy. Boss. Listen, I don't care what you do to me. I deserve it all from being disloyal. But you gotta forgive her. Forgive your daughter, boss. That's all I ask. No, daddy. No, no, no. I'm the bad one. It's my fault. If you're going to punish anyone, punish me. No, boss. It's all my responsibility. Oh, you died. Just blame right here. Daddy! Boss! Yuck! Enough! Quiet! Both of you! Fiamsa, my strong heart daughter, you used your last favor long ago. And you, Frankie, you were like my son to me. This is how you repay your debt to Don Peñanta. I feel such disappointed in you two. It's like a poison shroom is my gut. Daddy. Boss. Don't ever want to see your mugs again. You hear me? Get out of my sight, both of you. I don't care where. Just go. That's what you expected me to say, huh? Well, that's what I'm saying. Go. Do whatever you want, even if it means getting married. Oh, Daddy. Dad? No. Wait. I mean, boss. Thank you so much, Daddy. Thank you so much for your blessing, boss. I'll make your daughter a happy woman. I promise you. 
she'll want for nothing. Enough already! Just go! Go! Fiance, seeing you just happy makes me happy too. Congrats, both of you. Frankie, this is great. It ain't quite what I promised, but hey, things turned out okay, am I right? Goodbye, Daddy. Farewell, and thank you. You still here? Hmm. Well, you found my daughter, and you got her to come back here. Uh, just look at how things turned out. What a complete and utter soap opera. But hey, it's a deal's a deal. You can have your blimp ticket, like I said. Yes, we got our blimp ticket! It travels to Glitzville! Who knew that guy's got some her smiling her ear to ear? She's happy, that's good. Hey! I knew you were the right man for the job. Thanks a bunch, Pally. But I don't want to see that gloomy face of your yours no more. Don't ever come back here. I won't. I don't want to hang out with a mob boss like you. I just came here for my ticket, nothing else. My, my, we've done it, Mario. Next stop, Glitzville. You've got mail. You got mail. You got mail. Koopaly, how's life? Mario, Coops, how are you boys doing? I'm just amazed I had no idea a machine like this could be used to send messages. Technology, wow. I'm doing great. Drinking fresh spring water, picking white wildflowers, polishing my shell. This town seemed so boring ten years ago, but I see the world differently now. I bet you'll you'll like Petalburg more than you used to once you get back from your adventure coops. So where are you heading next? I want you to see the wide world, son. It'll be good for you, but don't go too far past that front door. <laughs> From Koopaly. Oh, it's this jerk. Okay. Not too special, but it's definitely not even worth anything. Okay, let's go to Glitzville and finally, for a long last, open up Chapter 3 of this game. This blimp goes to Glitzville. Will you be joining us on our flight today? Yes, I will. Ah, please allow me to check your boarding pass. Then please watch your step and step aboard. Alright, so we're going to Glitzville, guys. Riding in a blimp. 